This is a walkthrough video of 5740 Midnight Pass. We're at Gulf and Bay Club. Gulf and Bay Club on Siesta Key. This is Building F. And Building F, we're looking at Unit 505. The exterior of the building is currently on, being painted right now. But this is a Gulf Front unit. It is two bedroom, two bath. And excuse a little bit of tape here because it's about to be painted. So this unit's been completely remodeled, and it is um, 1,584 square feet under air. Nice 16-inch diagonal travertine marble tiles um, to the living area. I like this little niche here, um, which, is, which is, is, there's actually some really neat uh, plaster on the walls that was nicely done. The kitchen has been completely remodeled. And it's kind of a galley style kitchen with a little seating area here, plenty of cabinetry, and um, lots of serving area. Has a little wine fridge here, stainless appliances. It comes with a pretty blonde girl who, who uh, makes, she apparently cuts the limes, and that's uh, always a favorite to have a blonde cutting the limes, yes, for the gin and tonics. Okay. So here we have a little pantry area for your beach towels and beach chairs. But what you really came to see is this view. So we are on the top floor, direct Gulf front of Building F. Now Building F is in Gulf and Bay, probably one of the best buildings. It has its own little pool area. Um, and these windows open up completely all the way to, um, to, to let let the breeze in. It's warm out there today. The beach looks beautiful. The red tide seems to have gone. And we're back, back to business here on Siesta Key. But as you can see, we simply walk out right here, cross the bridge, and you're at the beach. And so both the main living area and the bedroom open up right to the to the beach here. So this unit is being sold furnished. And um, as ever, with everything you see here, the furnishings are quite nice. It's very tastefully decorated. And as you can see, that travertine marble uh, picks back up here in this area. And there's a Berber type carpet in the main area. You have French doors that open onto the master bedroom, which is nice and big. I like the light in the soffit up there. And again, you have these nearly floor to ceiling windows that open up and slide either direction. There's a little window that separates um, the living space, but there's a curtain that can be pulled down. But as you can hear, it's completely silent with the hurricane glass. The master bedroom is amazing because there's a lot of built-in features here. Uh, the cabinetry is exquisite with the uh, wardrobe built right in and then a little desk and office area. This is really nice because it is a big room. I believe that at one time there was a lanai um, that has been recaptured as living space. And I suspect that the lanai would have been over there. But now it's all under air condition. So, and it's very nicely done. Eight foot ceilings, a uh, little lower in, in the kitchen. But the master bath is great. Same high-end cabinetry. Um, you know, nice uh, tongue and groove, miter joints. And then there's a good size walk-in closet here um, with nice racks and cabinetry in here. And lots of nice little features like this little cabinet and niche. The shower is great. Uh, again, that tumbled marble all the way to the ceiling with glass door. Very nice. It's, it's perfect. Coming back through the master into the main area, we're going to take a look at the guest bedroom. The guest bedroom and guest bath, this is two bedroom and two bath. Um, and I do like all the furnishings. That it all fits very well. Um, you got a eat-in bar area. Currently, there's two bar stools. You could have three. As I come here, this will be the laundry room. And it's a good size laundry room with a wash sink. So having, having the laundry facilities in the unit is very nice. A little linen closet right here for lots of towels and then there's more built-in cabinetry in the in the laundry room the guest bath is a full bath same same type of granite same type of shower 
um, marble. It's all been really done well. There is absolutely nothing to do in this unit. So this is currently into, in a rental program, and it gets 8,400 in season and about half that out of season. Gulf and Bay allows you for a one-month minimum rental, but you can do that 12 times a year. So we're fortunate to get in this unit this week while it's not being rented, and so it's tough to see this unit during season. But um, again, the unit comes furnished. These, I believe, are Murphy beds. So both of these beds, you have two full-size beds that fold up into this built-in uh, Murphy bed chamber. So, so this room can easily be converted um, to something else, and the beds can be stowed out of the way. Um, so I, everything about this unit is beautiful. It, it comes furnished, but really, you're not going to get a better view other than... Um, well, the A building has good views and the F building has good views, but only the end units on the A building have views that compare with this. I really like how the focus is right out to the water, to the greenery, and it's absolutely beautiful. So I'm Jules Roman with Yorkshire International, 941-366-0000. And as always, thanks for watching.